Hello. Thank you for taking the time to join us on this screencast. This tour of the Numeta DDEX Messaging Gateway software will focus on digital sales report processing. Starting on the main page of our application, we click on the sales report icon, which will take us to a list of digital sales reports that reside on our system. You can see the file name, digital retailer, the recipient of the sales report, the sales activity period start and end dates, and the total number of transactions contained in the sales report. We can see a high-level overview of these sales activities by clicking this icon, and a summary report will be generated. It takes a few moments depending on the size of the sales report, but it gives us the ability to do a manual review of some of the sales data being provided by the retailer. Okay, here are our results. The top of the report contains summary information of this sales period, including the number of unique release transactions, total number of transactions, and gross revenue calculations. Below, we have release transaction level information, including ISRC numbers, track titles, and artist names. And over to the right, you have the sales transactions and calculated gross revenues per release. This report contains over 27,000 sales transactions. Scrolling down to the bottom, we can view the report execution time. In this instance, it took just over 30 seconds to process this report from an original DDEX DSR file with close to 350,000 lines of XML data. This sales report provides one with a basic understanding of the sales activity during a particular sales period, which is useful information. However, the typical next step is to match this information against your rights administration systems so you can generate an invoice to send to your business partners. In order to generate a proper invoice, we will need to query a rights administration system to determine the ownership and rights percentages for each of the ISRC codes contained in the digital sales report. For this screencast, we have set up a rights administration system out on a remote server, which we will securely connect to and perform these lookups. By clicking on the Create Invoice link, the system will begin generating an invoice. For each record listed in the sales report, the system must check the ownership percentages for each ISRC, which matches to our rights inf information contained in the external relational database. Once this information has been obtained, the system performs its royalty calculations and outputs an invoice file. In this demonstration, the invoice output is formatted in pipe delimited values in conformance with the SysAC CCID standard. Here you can see the header record, the invoice detail record, and the trailer record. And at the end of the file, you'll see it took roughly again 30 seconds for this invoice to be created. The DDEX gateway can be configured to output any number of different file formats, including CSV, Excel, PDF, or custom import formats used by financial systems or popular accounting software packages. That is all for now. Thank you again for your time. If you would like to learn more, please visit us at newmeta.com or email us at info at We look forward to hearing from you.